So today I'll be showing you how to make a wig without closure. Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Yukiria. My YouTube name is Black and Shine. So guys, today's video is a sponsored video from Denia Hair. They sent these uh, three bundles of human hair, kinky human hair for a review. And it also came with three parts closure. So guys, here is the hair. Let's unbox it together. So inside this pack, I have three bundles of kinky human hair from Denia Hair. Their hair is so wonderful. I love the texture of the kinky. The kinky, the length I have here is 22, 20, and 18. Then the closure is 16. So guys, and I know now that closure is so expensive in the market. Not all the people can afford to buy closure. So you don't need to worry. You can just go ahead and get their bundles if you don't have money for the closure because the hair is so wonderful. So I'll be showing you how to make this wig without using a closure. And it's a sewing method, very wonderful method that you will love. Look at how the three part closure is. Look at the tray bundles I have here from Denia Hair. So guys, let me loosen the hair and start the work. To sew this wig, I'm using a dumb cap so you just have to place your cap on the dummy head and arrange it very well the way you want it to be then you start sewing at the back of the cap so i'm going to allow you guys to enjoy this part because i believe this part is so simple and again before i go off if you have not subscribed to my channel kindly do so right now hit on that subscribe button so that you become part of this family and when you do remember to turn on the notification bell so that you get notification whenever we drop a new video so guys if today is your first time you are so welcome please do stay and watch this video from the beginning to the end because you will love what we are doing here we have a lot of goodies you know a lot of good tutorial for you style on how to make different types of wigs i know you will love it in here so stay tuned and enjoy
foundation for our no closure wig i'm going to go ahead and use my wig pins the ones you know anyone you have can serve you for this particular job so you just use it to measure the part so that your part can be very straight so after i pin it where i felt is a straight line i'm going to go ahead and use thread as you can see on the screen you know to follow the line so that there will be no mistake while i'm sewing after that i'll use my scissors and cut it off then i will start the part what i'll do now is to get another wig measure it with the space i have there then sew opposite i'm sewing opposite now so i have to leave a space between the thread and the the hair i'm sewing just watch i'm not sewing exactly on the thread there is a space there after that then we'll move over to the next step but just sew this one from the beginning to the end watch very well this is so simple there is nothing confusing in this part you will learn it if you watch closely so when i'm done sewing it so i'm going to go ahead and uh, braid this attachment is very tiny attachment just little don't make it to be too big then the way i braided it is very tight in a way that if you touch it you think is a stick i braided it so tight so braid it like that braid one that will cover that uh hair from the beginning to the end so after i braided it i will show you what i did next i am going to explain to you guys what i did here the braid you saw me braided the one i explained to you guys i'm going to use it you know after stretching the root of the hair i'm going to use it and place very close as in very close to where the thread is then the next thing i'll do is to sew it after sewing it the first time i'm going to come back and re-sew again to make sure that it's tight remember the sewing should be done on top of the thread down to the hair and the net that is how you have to follow it gradually and sew it do not you know like pass your needle across to the other side just follow the thread as you sew it
so guys basically i've started the second side of the week on this second side you have to be very very careful you know when you place your braided hair make sure you check it very well to see how your part looks like as you can see on the screen that is what i'm doing make sure the space you want for your part is okay and always remember to close up the hairs after you have placed the braided hair I've already sewed it so it's just the same process on the first side is what we are repeating time to remove the center thread that mark the parts so as you can see see it now see the parts is looking so so natural if you see this hair is looking i'm even contemplating you know leaving the wig like this because you won't even discover or find out that it's not a no closure wig this sewing method is the number one is super is beautiful and is so real so you need to try this remember all information about this hair will be in the description box below do check it out and patronize this company their hair is beautiful this is a kinky human hair from dinia hair their hair is so beautiful you need to get this baby for yourself so guys Thank you so much for watching. Remember to share, subscribe, like, and turn on the bell notification. Thank you guys. See you on my next video.